Hello, everybody. This is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer. I shot this for jewelry companies commercial. Um, well, a long time ago. Well, this is my subject today, and uh, I'm gonna make something creative, different image from this base image. And I got this image, and uh, also I made this pencil drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop used a filter called Find Edges as always and uh, I may not use this but I don't know uh, let me just turn it off now and just keep it and uh, let's get started I'm gonna start um, I'm gonna make duplicate from this one and I'm gonna smudge on this layer so I'm gonna just turn this one off, then just keep it. And uh, well, this image, I mean, I'm gonna smudge on this sand. Uh, I'm gonna use that uh, smudge tool, this Evolve. This is a pretty good smudge tool I used before. Okay. Now I'm going to smudge on these rings um, real small size of the smudge tool size and then let's see yeah start with rings and just when you smudge it just like uh, some kind of drawing image I really like this Evolve. That's really neat. That's pretty, pretty cool. Well, this spectral highlight just smudge to outside. It goes so nice. Okay, one down. Now next. When you smudge it, and uh, you lose all the details, but I'm gonna make mask to uh, show the details on the base image. So I'm gonna make uh, another layer. I mean, uh, another smudge image. So we just smudge it, then uh, make like really uh, losing details. That's fine. Well, that's the reason we're using the smudge tool anyways. Okay, last one to go. Alright, we got all the rings uh, smashed already and now I'm gonna make another okay, change name, rename, smudge one. Yeah. Okay, now I smudged these rings. Now I'm gonna make uh, duplicate this layer again. Then this is smudge two. Smudge two. Okay, I'm gonna go smudge again, but this time I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger smudge tool size. Make it bigger, then we're gonna lose all the details. It it more. So you don't see what that is now. Well, let's try all the creative image. Make him try it something different. Oh, 
I don't know what it looks like. Well, let's have fun. Maybe in the background, I'm going to smudge all. All the rings smudged. Now, make brush size bigger. Then smudge all the object on the background side. Maybe the outside of the frame. Look at this texture. Pretty nice. I like this. Some kind of dry media type, crayon or chalk or something like that. I'm just blending inside gradually. Just touch. Okay. Almost done for smudging. Now, now we got three images. One base image, then a smudged one, then second one, which is this is rough. Now what I'm gonna do is just make mask, then, uh, well, just reveal this mask with the brush now choose the brush painting to I like this too. Yeah, why don't I use this Lara Puna? This is cool. Okay. Now reveal the mask. No, just hide the mask this time. Okay, I'm gonna choose black brushes or Lara Puna. Then this is too big, so maybe this size and opacity is about 50%. I'm gonna hide this. Let's go from here. We see some more. Just selective. Selective. Um, how much we you want to show maybe make it make it bigger then overall inside just hide like this this is a mask right yeah we now showing the smudge one image i'm not gonna mask all everything just show some show the details a little bit okay we are watching somehow a uh, pretty rough image now I'm gonna mask uh, make mask on smudge one layer make mask then again same brush same now show these rings this is the one I'm just me oops what's this oh I gotta turn on this base image otherwise we're not gonna looking at it nothing this is the one so now stones are pretty sharp now this is base image right okay now you know why I'm kind of showing the smudge 2 image on this specular highlight then showing the stones on base image this Okay, we are using this mask on Smudge 2 and uh, also hide the Smudge 1 mask here. Okay. Now I'm not gonna mask everything and just see some.
Now we gotta be careful because even though you are masking this layer, I mean smudge one layer mask, but you have to mask it this smudge layer too. Otherwise, you're not gonna see this base image because you are masking. Now I'm masking here, right? You gotta mask two of them to show the base image. So in this case, just see, I'm reveal. I mean, uh, mask on this layer two first. Then after that, layer mask one again. These tones. Well, you know what I'm doing now. Okay, look at this. I'm touching this layer mask one. You don't see nothing because you are hiding here. So if you want to see the clear stone image, you're gonna mask here too, layer mask. So now we are mask both of them to look the base image. Okay, you got the idea. Now what I'm gonna do is from here. This is a long image, I said. Pencil drawing type. Okay. Now this layer though, I'm gonna mask, uh, make mask, then invert mask. Now you, you don't see this pencil drawing type image. If you wanna see this, you're gonna reveal this now, right? Okay, I'm using that uh, Lara Puna, that's the same. I'm not gonna change any, um, change to other brushes, no. But I'm gonna reveal, pick the white color to reveal this pencil drawing type image. Okay, now I'm gonna reveal this. Let's see, over here, Okay, make it bigger, then it's not, well, make it maybe 50% or so. Pretty big size. Now I'm revealing by showing nothing, right? Because this mask, oh, no, no, no. I'm choosing this um, eraser tool now, no. I'm using this brush a lot of puna and reveal this mask now here make it white that's not I that's not what I want to do I want to see the base image so I'm gonna change this blend mode now it's normal to darken so we can see through underneath Got it. Okay. This image change the blend mode to darken. So we see this. Black image, I said. This is this image. I'm gonna re I reveal this mask. Now, on and off, you see. Then. I want to see, let's see, I want to just show the outside lines, this lines, a pencil drawing type image, right? I changed this layer more, darken, but if I change this one now to lighten, which means I just reveal this mask, then show this light image. So now I'm going to change the brush to reveal this. Okay. I'm going to change the brush. Oh, well. Let's go with 
this first. Okay, just make it bigger. Then opacity about 60%. Some outside showing. I mean revealing here. So show that this pencil drawing type image we see that. Also like this ring. Let's see. Choose the black to make it hundred percent. Then a little bit smaller. Now we are watching, I mean uh, seeing the real image and pencil drawing type. So that's what I want what I'm gonna try now. Now you guys know what I'm doing. Okay. Now let's create something. Okay, I'm going to clear this again. I'm going to invert this. Start from here. Then I'm going to make it bigger. 100% Larapuna to reveal this with white. Right, reveal and show this. It's normal now. So lighten, darker, linear burn, light color, overlay. Well, let's see overlay and uh, I'm gonna mask with white. Hide. That's all right. Hiding. Hiding pencil drawing type image. Now showing which is more light. Pencil drawing type image does more white outside. So I'm gonna show the white area. Now I guess this is okay now. Well more emphasize these rings color wise, especially because I changed this pencil drawing type image, I changed the layer mode overlay. This one affects these colors, I think. Well, now, okay, from here, combine down, combine down, this one, combine down, all the layers, one group, now, then, okay, this one is, I'm gonna duplicate this group, button, then I'm gonna lighten up this, curves on the layer gamma I'm just looking at these stones red and stuff so just you see these stones lighten up a little bit contrasty and go up more 
let's see, far away. Yeah, about this much. Okay. And then I'm gonna make mask. Invert mask. Select net this same brush. It's, uh, this time it's gonna be airbrushing to uh, soft blend, medium blend. Yeah, about medium blend. Then make it smaller. Then reveal with white on this layer mask. Lighten up. You see some greens. This is fun. Okay, about this much. Now, turn this one on and off. It's lighting up these stones. You see? Okay, well, I guess that's it. We have the base here, one group. Then lighten up here. And done. Well, thank you for watching my video and uh, I hope this movie is going to give you some kind of idea to make, to create something for your work. Well, I really appreciate for you guys' support and uh, see you next time. Bye now. Ciao.